Want to learn how to create that outline around yourself on your YouTube thumbnails? You have come to the right video. Guys, a big huge welcome to my channel. It's Alice Gordon here. On this channel, I cover everything from marketing tips, motivation, as well as the spiritual stuff too. So if that's your jam, feel free to hang around the Goal Getter tribe. So guys, today I'm going to be talking to you and teaching you how you can add an outline around yourself for YouTube videos. Um, let me show you one that has that like so, okay? You can do so right inside of Canva. Um, I am no graphic designer. My son actually does all of these graphics, but I am pretty handy with using Canva and other tools. So I love to teach you guys how to get things done quickly using tools that you love, okay? So what we're gonna do is outline um, me in this picture here. Um, I'm First, I'm gonna go and I'm going to check to make sure that there are no outlines because I'm sure my son has already outlined me. So I'm gonna click restore to the original version of this photo, which as you can see, it's me in my office as the original photo. So the first thing that I'm gonna do guys while I'm here is go ahead and remove the background first. Because once you restore original, it takes everything away. I'm gonna cut myself out of the background. Okay, so there I am. So from here, I'm gonna continue to, I'm gonna apply. Okay, so that stays. And then from here guys, I'm going to add a shadow. I'm gonna click glow, which is like my favorite shadow to use. There's so much you can do with this. I just finished recording another video. I'm um, talking about how I add offsets to my um, stickers for my stationary shop and all that kind of stuff. So that's another video you guys can check out. But I love using glow. Um, so from here, the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm gonna change the color. So guys, I don't know what color. Let's just say I wanna make it pink. Okay, I want to outline myself pink. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the blur down because what's going to happen if I turn this size up and this is a nice effect too that I like to use sometimes. This is going to give me more of a blurry subtle effect and sometimes I use it. So if I really don't want to be that highlighted but I kind of want to stand out, I'll use this effect and I'll keep the blur on. But if I want that defined line, I'm going to turn the blur all the way down. I'm going to turn the transparency all the way up and then there you go. I have that line right around myself. Thank God to the heavens for Canva. They've made it so easy to do this. Back in the day, it was you had to use certain programs like Photoshop and all this other type stuff to get this effect. Now, good news, guys, you don't. So if you want to make it bigger, you're just going to increase the size. You can make that bad boy as big as you want to make it. Um, probably around about, I would say, the 10 to 13 or so area is good enough. I'm going to apply it. And then that's how the image looks. So guys, that's all you have to do to apply an outline to yourself for your YouTube thumbnails. As easy as one, two, three, thanks to Canva. So guys, if you're going to try this tool out, let me know in the comments that you're going to try this tool out. Um, if you don't have a channel and you're working on it, let me know that in the comments too. That lets me know that you watch this video and you are with the Go-Getter Tribe. So don't forget to comment below. Don't forget to like this video. Every time you like a video, guys, and pay it forward, it really does help my channel to grow. I really, really do appreciate you guys for supporting the channel. And thanks for hanging out with me today. Have a blessed day. I'll see you guys on the next one.